we are a uh, living and breathing uh, community driven uh, cultural center and tribal museum located in Mount Pleasant, Michigan. And we were brought on to this amazing project to assist in the collaboration and partnership uh, with the museum and also with Wayne State University and Cranbrook University, both from Michigan. Uh, they were looking for uh, a partner, a uh, tribal museum or a tribal community to help in the design and conceptualization of the exhibition and also to provide uh, the authenticity of our stories, uh, the truth-telling of uh, colonization, the boarding school era, forced removal, uh, treaty-making eras, and uh, the impact that it has on uh, our people today. Uh, when we think about colonization, you know, starting over 200 years ago and lasting for generations, uh, we also need to think about that the reverberation of that impact is still felt within our communities. And unfortunately, uh, our educational system in the United States does not provide uh, the truth about uh, the history of Native America and how our people have been treated uh, over the centuries. Uh, so this exhibition is uh, very intentional. It's well thought out and it provides a snapshot uh, of the truth and of the success of our people, you know, for us to overcome what we had endured for many generations. So with this snapshot, you know, we encourage uh, further exploration and research and understanding um, not only about, you know, the, the colonization and the impact of that on indigenous people in, in the United States and North America, uh, but to equate that to uh, what's happening around the world. Uh, it seems history is repeating itself in, in many forms even today uh, when we look at stereotypical issues and, and racism, uh, separation of, of children from their families, parents, and their homelands. You know, it's, this is something that's still happening and it's, uh, it's heartbreaking that we haven't come far as, as humanity. Uh, as we should in this day and age. So um, on behalf of the Saginaw Chippewa Indian Tribe of Michigan and the Zeboing Center, uh, we say miigwech gracias uh, to the museum, uh, to Dr. Tamara Bray uh, for encouraging Zeboing to become a, become a part of this groundbreaking initiative. And of course to Dr. Juan Sigui uh, and the museum staff here for providing this wonderful opportunity to inform not only people of Spain, but people of the world uh, about uh, Native Americans and our true story.